Hi everyone, thank you for joining us today for our hashtag Get Fit Anywhere S3 program. Before we get on to the strength exercise today, I would like to share with you that this program is a part of Get Active Singapore, where we celebrate a stronger Singapore through sport. So let's go. Hi everyone, I am Bernie from Feel Fit. Today I'll be talking to you about the sumo squat. This exercise places a greater focus on your inner thighs. It helps you maintain a more upright position and because of the upright position, it places less pressure on your lower back. And now I'll hand you over to Saudi, who will be showing you how to do a sumo squat. The exercise we're going to do now is called the sumo squat. So the setup is as such, you want your feet to be nice and wide, generally much wider than your shoulder width, okay? And make sure your toes are going to be angled outwards. So it's going to look like this. Okay, so how we're going to start, it's important to make sure that your body is generally upright. Okay, and you're going to bend at your knees and lowering yourself down towards the floor. When you're doing this movement, you want to ensure that you're pushing your knees outwards in line with your toes. So what we don't want is this. We want to make sure you're pushing, keeping actively pushing your knees out and in line with your toes. As low as you can go. And then from here, push the floor away with your whole feet as you stand. Alright, so again, as we keep our body upright, going down, bending knees, pushing the knee outwards in line with toes and pushing the floor away as I stand. So if you find that this is very difficult for you because uh, sometimes our adductors tend to be a little bit tight, then you just adjust the depth. You don't have to go so low. You just do what you can. So for some people, this is good enough for a start. All right, and then you can work to go lower. So we want to aim for three sets of 10 reps. So if it gets easy with body weight, you can start to load it, okay? So what I have here to load the movement is using a backpack. Um, this backpack is a little bit bigger, so I'm going to make it smaller by turning it in. But of course, you have a bag or a rice bag or even just a, a bottle of oil or something, you can use that. So as long as you can hold it nicely in front of you, that will work. So again, I'm going to place my feet nice and wide, angles, angling my toes outwards, keeping my body upright, lowering myself as I bend my knees and making sure that my knees are in line with my toes. And as I come back up, push with my whole feet. And that completes one rep. So this is the sumo squat. <laughs> 